On the Virgin Radio Breakfast Show in the year 2020, the musician, who is 60 years old, divulged the joke while he was discussing a song that he had written for the Invictus Games with Chris Evans. John Bon Jovi has been asking, what do I do? According to Prince Harry's joke. To whom should I address him? After that, I come to the conclusion that I will refer to him as the artist formerly known as Prince. In 1993, when Prince changed his name to an unpronounceable symbol, that was the name that was used to describe the late music icon of the United States. Bon Jovi composed a song about veterans of the armed forces who were suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder and gave it to the Duke, who was the one who came up with the idea for the Invictus Games, which are held for injured members of the armed forces. Before the song was released in the United States, I had written him a letter in August that contained the lyrics and the song itself. I mentioned that such a gift from me to the Invictus Games would be really special. To cut a long tale short there, and who could have ever known what could happen to him? He agreed, and he adhered to his word. Therefore, we are going to do it. So what it is, is that the Invictus Games had a choir, the celebrity continued. When I was writing the letter to him at the time, my objective was to say, I would like to give you the single. It would be a dream come true for me to be able to give something back to the individuals who have shown me so much love and support over the course of these nearly 40 years but I would like for them to be the ones singing. And then I'll be on the new record," she said. After that, we will release it as a single here in time for their games, and we will hopefully be able to raise some money for them. As a senior member of the royal family, Prince Harry made his way back to the United Kingdom yesterday, just in time for his last engagements. Following the announcement that they want to leave the palace and go to Canada, Prince Harry and his wife Meghan will be attending a series of events together. These will be their first engagements since the announcement.